took the test in 1999, recommendation of my father, who actually served 32 years as a New York City police officer. And uh, he just didn't want me to get on that job, so took the test. Um, and then a uh, best friend of mine was uh, with the anticipation of me passing the test and getting on the list. Really wanted to know when I was getting the call. Um, and uh, unfortunately, he passed away uh, September 11, 2001 in the Trade Center. Um, he worked in Cannon Fitzgerald and just, he was my motivation to really get on a job and see it through, become a fireman. It's a funny story. Uh, I did it at first. Um, my buddy called me up and said that he wanted me to take the test with him. And I was like, dude, this, this is not something I ever plan on being, you know? So as a favor, I said, yeah, all right, I'll take the test. Turns out, we got the same exact score. And he was my best friend, so I was like, that's great, you know, let's go through it together. So we, uh, exact, exact same score we got, so went through the whole process together. He ended up staying with the cops. I came into here and I still, uh, I still break his chops saying he made a, the wrong choice. Basically, uh, just wanted to help people. Um, before this, I was a Marine, so, you know, I just feel like it was my life calling to help people, pretty much. Well, it sounded exciting at, at that time. And I uh, wanted to help people. And I took the test while I was still on a Navy destroyer in Boston. I studied hard and I got the job and I'm very glad I did. I've been on for 12 and a half years and uh, I'd have to say if I could describe them fast. 12 and a half years, goals, snap of a finger. Well, this is my 30th year. It's been a good ride. Enjoyed all my time on a job. I'm very thankful and blessed to have this opportunity. It'll be nine years in August. I started in uh, 2007, and uh, it's, it's gone real fast. I still can't believe it'll be nine years. It's just incredible to me for me to say that, but uh, it's been a lot of fun. <laughs> Um, feeling a fight in a fire is uh, it's pure adrenaline. Um, you get the call for a fire, you respond. Once it's confirmed that it is a fire, you're uh, going to work, man. You're just really doing what you train, you know, every day for. You drill on, carry out your positions, and basically just try to make a bad situation better. Uh, probably an old lady. We went, went to a fire, we were first due. Um, our boss went into the apartment and uh, he found, doing a search, he found uh, an old lady on the floor, she was passed out. Brought her out into the, uh, into the hallway and uh, I was kind of just like freelancing, I guess, at the time, uh, second to control and I was helping with the stretch and uh, she was laying on the floor and she, it didn't, she didn't look good. But uh, I, I knew how to bring it downstairs, so I picked her up. And guys joke around because I said I carried her like a bride. I brought her downstairs, and uh, she wasn't looking good, but I started doing uh, CPR on her. And uh, she started coming around. I could see she, she coughed a little bit. And then uh, CFR engine came around, started helping me out. And then uh, the EMS got there, and uh, I was really concerned, wondering if she made it or not. Uh, found out later that she did. She made it and uh, she had a full recovery. And I was pretty happy about that. I got her out, of, got her downstairs to the EMS pretty quick. So that's something I'm always uh, proud about. Um, one memory for me, I guess, is my first memory, getting my assignment in the academy. And uh, walking into the firehouse, you know, with your hands filled with pastries and cookies and meeting the guys and, you know, kind of just being accepted. Um, knowing that you know, you trained and worked so hard for that moment. Um, your nerves are through the roof and uh, you just show up, you go through emotions and they show you around. And uh, you know, it's just, it's kind of nice to uh, 
feel like you've uh, accomplished the academy and you know you're on to something that's uh, talked about as the greatest job in the world and you know you're, you're it now. Every day in the firehouse is just a great day. It's a lot of fun. It's your home away from home. You're here with your family, the brotherhood, and uh, you know, it's just just a good time. Thank you.